I think what is often objected to in, in my novels by those people who object to them has everything to do with the explicitness of the language, and especially the language that writes about or describes sex. But people who feel constrained about sex and who feel that writers should be more constrained than they are about it, they're not always forthcoming about what it is they object to. They don't like to admit that they're prudish. Um, and so they say things like, I don't know what's the matter with contemporary literature and contemporary film and contemporary theater. It's, all they write about is dysfunction. All they write about is relationships that are a mess and families that are just awful. I don't know why they, they can't write about the things that, well, you know, more classical things. I can't tell you how many times I've heard that. Well, I guess you can't get much more classical than that period between 400 and 500 BC when Sophocles was writing the Oedipus cycle. Not one play about incest, but three. Um, I suppose people who complain about contemporary stories would find somehow that distasteful. Um, a man who murders his father, sleeps with his mother, and as a result, all the children will die. Well, that seems a little extreme. Um, or look at all the things that happen in Shakespeare. Did Macbeth have a functional marriage? You know, was Lear a good father? Um, was Hamlet's mother well behaved? Yeah, it's dysfunction, family disasters, relationships that were terribly wrong, um, or doomed, or cursed. It, it was the stuff I learned from the classics. It, I got it from the classics. So when people complain about too much unhappiness in contemporary storytelling, I think they're really complaining about something else. Um, they're complaining about the graphic detail. They're complaining about the explicitness of language. Possibly they're, I don't know, they're, they're, they're people who should read much tamer stuff, but don't tell me that they want to go back to the classics because that's where the bad stuff came from. Bad in my view, meaning good, right? Um, it's hard to find a family that's um, more dysfunctional than Hamlet's.